Hello again. Hello. Good morning. Bon dia. We're in the center of Lagos right now on our way to have the best espresso <laughs> ever in Lagos. <laughs> and you get to come with us. <laughs> We're lucky enough to have an apartment that's really pretty close by the center, not too far of a walk. So every morning we get to hop into the old town and make a walk. And they are decorating right now for Christmas. Unfortunately, we have to leave on Saturday for Villa Mora. But hoping maybe we can find a place here around Christmas so we can experience Lagos at Christmas time. I'm sure it's really beautiful. walked around so much and I still really have no clue where everything is. <laughs> we were just talking this morning that we could be here easily for a month and make, take a walk every single day and not understand everything here. <laughs> it's really pretty amazing. I went to school at the University of Colorado in Boulder and this reminds me of my university town a little bit, the feel, Chinese which food. I like very much. There's a lot of all-you-can-eat places for Chinese food and sushi. Um, for a fixed price, but be careful at those places because the food might be at a fixed price, but the drinks are really expensive. So when you think you're saving money, maybe not so much. So right now we are walking to our favorite little coffee shop called Black and White, and we will be sure to show it to you. But here we are at the coffee shop without patience to go in and get espressos and a green juice. is an incredible little English bookstore which I was beyond excited to find for 10 years, maybe more. I have not bought a book to read that's not digital because of traveling and they're kind of heavy in the suitcases. So when we came here, we found a sign that said English books and we found this awesome little place. Uh -huh. So the name of the bookstore is Owl Story English Books and it's absolutely adorable. The man who owns it is just a nice man, a sweetheart, I guess I could say, that he's from England. And it was just beyond fun to be able to walk in and get a book, which I did. It was a distance of the Iberia. And Jan, he said this is the only English bookstore in all of the Iberian Peninsula. Yeah. And what is also pretty great about the bookstore, see, I need your head in there. You're so tall, it's hard to get both of our heads in. Make it have some of the to Uh huh. And what is also great about the little bookstore, what we understand is that when you purchase the book, you can 
turn it back in for a little bit of money and it's like a it's like a library basically so i was really excited <laughs> yep <laughs> check the mic and make sure it sound right boys